Hi, John Maxwell here. I'm glad you're here with me on Minute with Maxwell. I've been talking about moral authority, the highest authority of all, given to you by the people, not by yourself, achieved through consistency and excellence of a lifetime where people trust you and have had good leadership experiences with you. In our last session, I talked about the first step to the pathway of moral authority is competence, just having the ability to lead. I'd like to talk to you today about courage, which I define courage as moving forward in the presence of fear. You see, what I've always understood about great leaders is that they gain their reputation on very difficult ground. They've never gained their reputation on doing something quick. They've never gained their reputation on doing something easy. It's always the fact that the respect and the reputation they gained was people watched them during the hard times, the dark times, the difficult times. If you name any great world leader, one that is esteemed, I will promise you the one common denominator, all these great leaders that are highly esteemed in the hearts of people, I can promise you the one thing they all have in common is they took people through very dark times. You see, that's where the making of a great leader happens. And without courage, it ain't going to happen. And courage isn't the absence of fear. If you have an absence of fear, you're not courageous. You have mental issues that you need to go see a psychiatrist about. We all have fears. We all have those things before us that we really don't want to face. We all do. I do. You do. The issue is not do I have fears in my life or giants in my life. The issue is am I willing to move forward? Am I willing to tackle them? Am I willing to do the hard thing? Because here's what I know. Every successful enterprise and every successful team goes through adversity to get there. On the other side of difficulty is always the dream and the answer. But you've got to go through the door of difficulty first. There's no such thing as good things happening without bad things first appearing. So it takes courage. It takes a leader who will stand up and be the example, lead the way, and encourage the people and give them security to follow. It's a great trait, and all leaders with moral authority demonstrate continually courage. They've earned it because they've earned it on difficult ground. John Maxwell here. Glad you're with me today on Minute with Maxwell.